morning. Hello oh, and welcome to my daily vlog of life for our beef and our fam here in South Yorkshire. Um, if you like this sort of thing, remember to like and subscribe. When I came in the yard, I bumped into Ash and Mick, so here they are. How come your two are here so early? You nearly caught us. Well, I, I thought, I thought I did. You were, you were putting your coat back on. You so you got lipstick around your mouth. I'll have more than lipstick in me these. I'll have some red stuff called blood. <laughs> that is a fantastic sunrise, isn't it? That's pretty impressive. It's nearly as red as me at it. We've got an ash puck hat on today. Business. Right, so we'll get things started. I think first of all, we'll start up the nine meter. They're in the barn over there, um, waiting for the pigeons and crows to come in. And uh, just getting everything started, just filled up the 6.9, getting rid of the rubbish. And got, yeah, I think every machine pretty much has started now. TM started, 125, uh, 1.30, sorry, started, and the 9 metre, so we're all running, it's all good. 100% today. You alright then, Michael? Yeah, I am. I'm happy to. You have been? Uh, oh, I like that. It's yeah, a busy day at work. I'm a busy week, isn't it? You've had a busy day at work? Yeah, uh, busy week. Uh, can I, uh, I want to get some of the posts out of them, you know, the posts, which we saw a few of them up for out. What, some fence posts? Yeah, the, the nag bugger ones. Are you sure? Yeah. They're sure in trail, but I know they are. I just can't get up, get them. What, you mean? No. Whoa. Trailer? Yeah. No, no, no. There's them, there's them lengths that need sawing up. What lengths? Them that's on floor. Them, them lumps of wood. The them up there. Branches, branches. They're too, they're not dry enough yet. They need to go them. I know. They need to go from a white trailer, that's yeah. all. Yeah. I'm going to take some of the other posts first, all right. No. You've got plenty. Yeah, don't You need to me. cut them up. You've been burning them already. The I ant, I've had to put them to dry. To wet burn. So I'm having a couple Have of you moisture tested them? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> to work. <laughs> but yeah, the way the women I've had them on. Anyway. Yes, okay. I'm gonna have one or two. Okay. I need Only that. One. I need Ash to get them dry because I can't get up my leg, can I? Oh, is that what you got Ash here for, is it? I'm gonna try something a bit daring. Next bale. I've cut all the bands off. So we'll just try picking it up. We'll not have to get back out. Potential for me to make a lot of mess though if uh, if I don't back up to this right. But if I can, it will save me a lot of time um, in the morning. Well, not a lot of time, but it will save me time in the morning. In this pen, we've got the new cattle that came yesterday and the yards that we mucked out. <laughs> oh, it's very windy today. I reversed up to it. Let's see if we've got it. Oh, back of the net. Back of the net. Look at this, it's, it's nicking me wood. My hard earned sweat, blood, and tears wood. Things I do for that man. The mix being a good earn, he's letting me in all these pens with the straw blower. We'll get these guys done. My dad's fetching some hay and silage round on the TM. We've got the spreader bale on, so we're going to put that in the bottom pen down here. Watch the llama video, you'll know that Spreader Bale won the gold award for, um, I can't remember what it was, like new piece of equipment or something. So they've got like a side shooting one. <coughs> it shoots it to the left, to the right, and it can also shoot it forward as well. Um, so yeah, it's uh, an interesting machine really, but I think that one's the best for what what we wanted to do down here because we wanted to just spread it all over at the front. But for going down calf pens and stuff, it looked like it'd be perfect. He's there using it now. Uh, it's got two rotors, maybe you could just see when he lifted it up then. The uh, the machine that I was on about just has the one. Um, a lot bigger one. So, yeah, we really like that one. And it's really old as well, it just lasts forever. It does a, uh, a good job with my foot, there we go. That one all chilled out and relaxed. He's not getting up, is he? No, he is. We'll put 
putting hay in here. I can imagine this is going to go everywhere, and I'm going to have to pick it all up. We're just going to drop the teagle off, the straw blower, and put the mill on. Ah, this is what annoys me. So we're now move two tractors, telehandler and uh, 210 to get the mill. No, no, maybe just the 210 actually. Anyway, we're going to go and have a drink first. Should we renew our internet security with these guys? Or do you know a better internet security company? Let me know in the um, comments below because it's coming up for renewal should we even bother i think we should but um i'm not a tech genius or anything but i'm sure there's some people watching that will um yeah know what we should be getting yeah some help please comments below business just had a drink this has been chopping up while we've been having that just gonna take half of the chopped up straw and silage out we've got the rest of the stuff to put in, we're probably going to do some milling as well because um, it's going to get windy at the start of the week. It's windy enough today, but it's going to get even more windy, so get a bit of milling done. It's all coming out now. What's happening this weekend then? Any parties? No, sleep. Sleep? Ah. You can't get any sleep, can you? I need some beauty sleep at all. <laughs> Plenty in it. You've got your, bit of your gangster lean on, haven't you, again? You know what? Your gangster walk. Does that mean? Your legs hurting, isn't it? It's a bit better. Well, it was. I, I, I nipped it last night. You, what? Nipped it, getting out of the truck. Oh, right. Sorry. Sorry. No. <laughs> oh, that like kid. Too old. 16 March. Are you? Oh. We're having a big 60th party, then. Are you spending some room, money? I think going on. <laughs> Oh, man, cave, man cave party? Do I get invited? Yeah. Do I? Yeah, of course I will. You sure? Ah, nice one. Get out of the way. I'm on the 215 now. The spaceship. Uh, I'm going to try and walk this out. Oh, that's forwards. I'm going to be going in reverse. Walk it out of this little gap that we've got here. It does have a good turn on it, to be honest. It's, I don't want to have to... Is it going to go round? Honestly, it's just such a big tractor, but it's really nimble. Compared to that 210 that we've got, this is a ballerina. And well, this is supposedly the higher horsepower tractor. Turnable fenders make a big difference. So I've parked the 215 up there. We're now in the 130. Got the mill on. We'll get some milling done. Chinese have even started branding their clippers now. Good job. It won't, it won't be a good job, but it will last like and be more cost effective than the really expensive ones. Um, yeah, I'll give it a go. That's the old one, this is the new one. Wow, don't they look similar? Because they're all the same pretty much. Just, um, yeah, just go for the cheapest one. Pipes rock, on it, mate? Just shove it, Joe, shove it. Shove it, like you Just shove it, Joe. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> He's your weight behind it, mate. Big, big hammer on it. <laughs> there we go, pipe is fixed. It's nice to hear that. I think it's bent and flexed and what have you. So we got um, more cattle to clip and record their weight. This is not good. How on earth have you got in there? What a mess you caused. Oh no. You idiot. This gate here was left open at the side of the crush. Wasn't it? Hey? Come on then, you pretty. Let's have you out. Sounds like she's got a carrier bag stuck to her. You are naughty. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Um. Oh, 
Like she's not this about a bit. This is not good. But I've got it fixed. Oh, tags everywhere though. Obviously I've pulled them off the table. There's management tags. October my clipper boxes. Empty ones. And I'm also filling the mill up, keeping that running at the same time. Oh, he's looking for a few cattle now. When a cow's like that, it sometimes worries you a little bit. Oh, he's just having a deep sleep. Hiya, buddy. Hiya. Yeah. <laughs> He's having a nice dream. I'm just looking in here and I'm thinking, you know what, I wish we could change this just into a smaller pen. And then we won't have to have anybody open that gate for us. It'd be like, exactly like the next aisle along. You'll be able to just come down, feed them, not need that second person. But my dad is intent on, how, on keeping this outside yard, which looks nice now, but when it gets wet, it's um, it's not nice. I mean, I've, I've stored it up plenty well in your flight, but yeah. And then we could go out at the end there and loop back round up the other side. It'd be perfect, you wouldn't even have to back up. It'd just make things so easy. Put troughs in, feed out with a mixer. Would improve life a lot. Yeah, it'd look identical then to this here. And you'd go around there, turn left, and then come back up the other side of this building. Easy peasy. We're filling up the mill anyway. So I've just been washing lorries out and um, unblocking drains with drainage rods. And now we're going to do a bit of feeding around the farm, um, I'll let me dad in a few other pens. Um, and then I've got a mix to do, got more straw to fetch around. It's gonna be a late one tonight. So we've got that going in down there. These guys playing with the gate. Oh yeah. Cheeky mister. He's quite happy with that. <laughs> I've got to put my hand on there, mate. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Mill off. Straw blower on. It's had some work today, this tractor. Right, we'll go and get some straw down and set out ready for tomorrow morning. It's getting dark. Today's mix invention is a happy birthday to John Hollyfield, who is 64 today. Um, we're raising money for Yorkshire Air Ambulance. Um, it's a charity thing where you donate a little bit and you get your name mentioned in the video on the mixer or some other form of machinery around the farm. So um, well over seven and a half thousand pounds for, is it seven and a half? It might be six and a half. I can't quite remember. I'll get back to you tomorrow on the grand total for mixer ventures, but we're into the six and seven thousands worth of poundsness for the air ambulance, which is fantastic. So happy birthday, John business right so i've been left now <laughs> my dad's gone in i've got that to put away that to put away that to put away straw blower that's around there to put away and then um then i'm done oh four tractors to put away lights right let's go put this away we're in the 215 Will she get round? Will she get round? Will she get round when we make it go round? Yeah, yeah, it's done it. Oh, I tell you what, she might be a bit slippy on there. I wanted to try and get a lot of the muck off the tyres though, of course. It's going to sit here for a bit. Nobody's done any sweeping up in sheds, so I would, I would have put it down there, but not gonna happen i have to sweep that up uh, tomorrow six nine it's time to go to bed this one is a beast though and finally the 130 that's beeping at me um god 
there's lots of beeping here, isn't there? It never stops beeping this tractor. Um, yeah, I'll we'll put this one in and away for the night. That's the last one. Okay, she's in. Lights off, I think. Oh no, they stay on automatic, don't they? That's it, that gets them off. Everything is away, TM's in there as well. That's the one that my dad put in um, before we went in. Job done. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I massively appreciate everyone um, that tunes in every day, watches the videos, or just tunes in every now and then and watches whatever. Um, it's just, yeah, it's really great that people want to see what's happening on a farm in the UK. Um, who'd have thought it that I'd be videoing this and people had tune in to, to watch it uh, I nearly said find it interesting but <laughs> I'm not sure I don't know do you find it interesting I'm not sure um, if uh, if you like it remember to press the like button anyway subscribe of course if uh, if you're not already and um, let us know how you're feeling as a percent I'm probably like 75% today it's not been like fantastic but it's not been terrible um, this cold's a bit crap and yeah just like some bits around the farm are frustrating me. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that's it from me. Thank you very much for watching and we will see you tomorrow. Business. Bye.